Hey guys! So, I decided to make videos Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And look, I got rid of my 90s TV. Now it's all pretty. So, today's video is what's in my new purse. And happy first day of spring to you guys. If you guys have spring weather. Unfortunately, I have snow on the ground. But it's warm outside, so that's a bonus because all that shit's gonna melt. Yay! So I got my cool Roxy Van Pador uh, hat. hat. And I'm wearing white Converse. And then my jeans are from Hollister. My top is just like one of those sweaters like this. I got this, I think, from Wet Seal. No, H&M. No, not H&M. Oh my god, what's that store? Charlerous, Charlerous. And that's what I'm wearing today. And then what I'm wearing on my face is Kylie's um, Posey K lipstick, which is one of my favorite ones that she has. I have two others, which is Candy K and Court K. Then my mascara is just some Sephora um, mascara because the one I used to use was from Urban Decay Big Fatty but they discontinued that so that fucking sucks so the lady at Sephora recommended this one and it does just as dust dust dash but it's not waterproof so that's not the happiest thing so when I do want to wear waterproof I use um, Better Than Sex from Too Faced then for my bronzer and my blush I used IT and it's like this like round palette that has blush, bronzer, and highlighter. So I used all that. And then my bottom base, I had some pimples, so I used the green stuff to take out the red. So that's what I did. And I feel really great today, which is awesome on my part because yeah, it just does. And so from that I got a new purse a couple weeks ago, which I saw in Nordstrom, and I was like, oh my god, this is too expensive, I can't get this, because I already bought, I bought a new Louis Vuitton not too long ago, so yeah, <laughs> and I was like, I don't need this, Allison, I don't need this, and, but I end up getting it, <laughs> but on KateSpade.com, and they're having sales, so I saved almost quite, like, $100. So the bag was almost like $400, so I spent like $289. So this is what it is. I just added um, my uh, like a charm to it, and like it comes with a charm, so it's Kate Spade. Here it is. And so I had obviously this pom-pom. And it's like, it's a cream, it says cream online, but in person it's more of a pink color. And um, it's also crossbody, and I love crossbody bags. They're just my favorite, and I absolutely love this bag. And all the metals are gold, and they have the little feetsies at the bottom, and it's just perfect. If you don't want to wear crossbody, you could go this way. So yeah. So one of my favorite things about this bag is that if it gets wet or you use something like soda, because I happen to know like like two days after we get in this bag. Soda spills on it, it dries, no worry, cause this is like waterproof. So you just, and it's tough, so you could just rub it out. So I love that. That's one thing I wish Louis Vuitton had, cause I know their um, bags, their leather isn't treated, so the, it will patina and like, if it's raining outside, like that's like the biggest no-no not to wear your Louis Vuittons outside because when it's raining at least, because it'll just stain the crap out of them. And it's like so sad because you spend so much money on a bag and it gets like kind of ruined. So, yeah. So that's what I love about this bag. And this is the Street Tegan something. It's one of their larger bags in the Tegan, um, Street Cameron Tegan line. So, yeah. So there's the that comes in cream, black, and blue. So I got cream, but it's more like a pink in person. So let's get into what's inside the bag. So let me put them close together. So a bag comes like this. It's open. So if you're not into being having like open bags, definitely not the bag for you. The line, the collection line has other bags that aren't all open like this, so you might find something else. So, like you see, it comes with two, like, 
zipper sections here. So in the, the back zipper section, I usually keep my wallet in here. So nobody could grab your wallet from because it's open. So I just keep my wallet in here. My wallet's from Ralph Lauren, Lauren Ralph Lauren. Love it. Found that TJ Maxx. Spent like basically nothing on it because originally it was like a hundred something. And it just looks like this. And my ID usually was in here, but it gets stuck on the fabric in here. I'm always going to some places I need fucking ID'd. So, yeah. So I just keep everything over here. And these are just my MasterCard and my Visa. My health insurance card. This is my boyfriend's business card. He's a DJ. He's pretty cool. You should definitely check out his music. I have business cards. And I have, like, this rewards chocolate factory thing in here. My Sephora card, my Airy card, my BP Gas, and of course Panera. So that's what I have in my wallet. So I'm just going to put that back in this part. And then... Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Okay. And then, in this front zipper, I have... Maya headphones some mint headphones and usually if I'm at work I keep I take the phone charger from my car and I put it in the front pocket so I guess it's my media pocket so yeah so those are the outside inside pockets so let's get inside the bag where all the fun stuff is you guys so I usually have my phone inside my bag but I don't and I usually have my keys but my keys are downstairs so, you know, yeah. Um, so, let's get inside. So, I always have straws in here for some reason. So, I have another straw somewhere. Then I have my makeup bag. And it's from Juicy Couture. And it's nylon on the outside. And basically fits everything and keeps it all sucked in. Then I have my work ID. It's not like to eat, it's just to get into doors. Here's my other straw. My ring pop. It sounds broken, it might actually be broken. I keep this lip stainer. It's from Stell. Stella. Stella. Yeah, Stella. I absolutely love it. It's pomegranate. Eh. I got my Burt's and Bees Flavor Crystal Lip Balm. Then my other favorite lip balm, which really works. And then I just have a lot of band-aids in here for some reason. Then in the other pocket, I have this little, like, mirror. Ooh, mirror. I don't ever use it, but I just keep it because I feel like it's necessary. It's necessary. And then I have my bag of meds because I'm a spoonie and spoonie people need their drugs at all times. So that's what's in here. I have a bunch of meds. I definitely need a new baggie because it is busted open and it won't zip up. So yeah, I'm going to put this back in here. I'm going to put my straws in first because straws are fun. And don't ask me why I have straws. I just do for some reason. Um, I have like collection i end up with a collection at the end of the week from like extra straws wherever i go out to eat with my colleagues so yeah and then i don't think i explained this in the beginning of the video you guys are probably wondering allison it's monday in the afternoon why are you home well friends friends and fans and guys and girls well unfortunately my building has a gas leak so they don't want it to go boom with people inside of it, so they told us to stay home today, which was very nice. It was a great Monday surprise, definitely. So, then in this pocket inside, I just have a bunch of personal hygiene stuff, like lady stuff. So, I'm not going to really show that to you guys. So, really, this is what's in my bag. And this bag goes for $348 without being on sale. So if you're looking for a nice spring bag and you want it to last, definitely look into Kate Spade. So, yeah. Wee. Oh my god. I love my outfit today. I definitely feel like I'm like... I dug my keys into this legacy. With the booby dot dot. I feel 
feel super Indiegogo today. That's what I feel like. <laughs> and it's Ultra Week, guys. If you guys are into EDM music and you don't know what an Ultra Music Festival is, it's in Miami. It's just a, like electric music festival, as I said previously. And it's like one of the biggest events in the year if you're into that music. So, yes, I'm not going to it. But my aunt lives like an hour from it, so if I decide to go next year, I could stay in my aunt's house. But, uh, yeah, so it's in Florida, Miami, and it's like a big thing, and it lasts for like three days. And, um, it's just fucking awesome. And that's like one of my top dream things to go to, which is Ultra, Tomorrowland, and EDC. So, yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed my, um, what's in my bag. And I'll see you Wednesday.